huge thanks to Teddy Blake for sponsoring today's video. Hey guys, it's Nyla. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a what's in my purse slash purse collection video. I've been seeing a lot of comments on my Instagram, YouTube, all that stuff of you guys asking me to do this video. So I'm going to be bringing y'all this video today. I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. Give it a thumbs up and make sure you guys subscribe if you guys aren't already. Also, follow me on my social medias. They'll be here on the screen. If you guys want to know more about my day to day life, my personality, YouTube updates, how I feel about things, all that good stuff. You can follow me on my YouTube spam. I accept everyone. It'll be here on the screen if you guys want to check that out. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and let's go ahead and jump into it. So as I said, this video is sponsored by Teddy Blake. So they sent me over a really, really nice bag. This is the box that the bag comes in. It's really, really nice. So this is the first thing that you see when you open up your package. I feel like presentation is everything when you're purchasing something. So I love their packaging. It's really, really nice. So when you open up the box, it opens like this. It has Teddy Blake at the top. And then they also provide you with a dust bag. So here's the dust bag. It fits the bag perfectly. So if you want to store it or maybe you want to take it with you, but you don't want your bag to get scratched up, this is a good way to store it. So here's the bag that I picked out. This is their Royal Blue Paul Mulatto Leather 12 inch purse. So they have different sizes. You can get the 12 inch, which is kind of like in the middle, but they also have larger sizes and smaller sizes. Just in case any of you guys may be interested in purchasing using your own Teddy Blake bag. I'm just going to go through some of the specs and details for y'all. Then I'm going to let you guys know how I feel about it and show you guys what I'm storing in the bag. So first of all, Teddy Blake is a very affordable brand. They have really nice genuine leather purses. If you smell it, it does smell like genuine leather and it does feel really, really nice. It's not cheaply made or anything, so the quality is really nice. The bags are also made in Italy, which is really, really cool. So the outside is genuine leather, as I said. And then the inside is suede. And like I said, this is luxury for you because I know like very high-end brands can be super expensive, but you can get the same look and feel for a cheaper price. And there are a variety of different colors, sizes, styles that you can choose from on their website. Y'all should definitely check them out. I'll have the link to their website and all that good stuff down below. And if any of you guys are interested in purchasing your own bag, I do have a coupon code that will get you guys $20 off of your order and it's going to be here on the screen. It's TB Nyla 20 so if you guys want to check that out, you can use it and get $20 off of your purchase. Now let's go ahead and get into how I feel about the bag and what I store inside the bag. So like I said, I have the Bella Palmoletto bag and it's in the royal blue color, 12 inch. I'm going to start with this pocket right here in the front. Like I said, there's two pockets. I'm definitely going to do close up so you guys can see the full detail because I know just like sitting down, you can't really see. So in the first compartment, I have gum. You guys know I always have gum on me i like to keep these extra the actual like big containers i like these and whenever i get a new pack of gum i'll just fill it up i don't know i just like this container better than like the paper gum container and then next i have my airpods in here so if i want to listen to music or anything like that i have these these are three things other than gum that i'm always 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 going to have so i have a little compact mirror this is some hand sanitizer from bath and body works because especially right now with the pandemic going on you definitely want to make sure you have hand sanitizer so this is the a thousand wishes scent and it has glitter in it and just because it has glitter does not mean that it's not effective and then i also have lip gloss i have a lot of lip gloss in my purse i don't know if it's just me but i keep at least like three lip glosses in my purse for whatever reason i don't know this video also kind of doubles as like a what every girl should need in their purse kind of video if you guys are wondering like what you should keep in your purse these are like some of the essentials that i think everyone should have in their purse it's obviously up to you but you know 
you know. So then in the back compartment, it's the exact same as the front, but it's one in the back as well. By the way, the hardware on the purse is gold. And y'all know I like silver, but I actually like the combo together. I think it's cute. And that's another thing on their website. They also have the same exact purses, but you can choose the hardware either in gold or in silver, which I really like. So you're not limited to one color choice. So you can either have the blue bag with silver or the blue bag with gold. And I really like that. So in the back, these are all, or not all, but most of my quarantine essentials other than my mask. So I have a little mini Lysol and then I also have some wet ones in here. These smell really good. They're in the scent Tropical Splash. But yeah, so I have these. So when I go out, don't play, honey. I'm going to wipe it down, spray it down, you know, make sure everything is clean and sanitized because we don't have time and then this is the second lip gloss this is the matte lip glass don't waste your money on this like i wanted this for the longest time because i thought this was such a like bomb lip gloss but honestly the beauty supply ones are better this is just like really thick and sticky but it's cute though so those are the two little front and back compartments and now we're gonna get into the main compartment and i know some of you guys are like well, how do you close the purse? We're going to get into that too. Um, I'm going to show you guys probably in the close-up. But there are two little snaps on either side. And you snap it together just like that. And that semi-closes the bag. So I keep my wallet in my purse, of course. So the first thing that I have in here is my ID. Please excuse my nails, but I do have to cover up my school name. So this is my ID. And then I have my cards and everything in here. And cash, whatever. Then... I always have these essentials on me. I usually have a mini deodorant in here too, but it's over there. Anyway, I have a fragrance mist and I also have lotion because you never know when you need to freshen up or you might be ashy or your friend might be ashy, whatever the case may be. You want to make sure you have everything that you need on you at all times. So I have these and this is from Bath & Body Works. It's in the scent Japanese Cherry Blossom. So I have these. And then I also, this is like most of the stuff is stuff that I bring to school either in my actual bag or in my crossbody bag because I do bring two bags and that might be extra to you but that's just how I do it so this is one of the things because it's not obviously it's not going to fit in a crossbody but since this purse has enough space I have my umbrella in here because you never know especially if you live in North Carolina the weather is very bipolar so it might snow it might rain it might be sunny you never know this is another thing that would be in my school bag because it's too big to fit in my crossbody but this is just an emergency kit that I made for myself I make one of these every year but basically I'm not gonna open it and get into it but there's just like painkillers pads anything you might need is in here extra lip gloss just in case so this is always like a lifesaver it has everything that you need so I have this I have another hand sanitizer this is a Germex one though so it doesn't have any glitter or anything in it but it's still effective so I have another hand sanitizer because you can never be too safe especially with the situation that's going on right now next I have some shades I do have some shades in here because I've been wearing them these are from Shein if you guys are wondering they're just like this they're really really cute I have these I love like black shades that are like oversized they're just really cute to me they give me like celebrity vibes so I have those in my little case so they don't get scratched up and then I have this little block. This is a Samsung block, but it gets the job done, okay? So I'll usually have like a portable charger and a charger, but I'll also bring a block. And then the last thing that I have is my keys. And yes, I have mace on here because you never know. Somebody might try to walk up on you. You know, you gotta protect yourself. So I have that. But I also have my P.O. box key and then my house key. So yeah. So that's everything that I have in this bag. Another thank you to Teddy Blake for sending over this purse. It's such a cute purse. I love it. If you guys want one for yourself, make sure y'all use my code to get $20 off of your order. It'll be here on the screen. Once again, it's TB Nyla20 so y'all can get money off. Yeah, that's everything that's in here. This is not all that can fit in here. There's so much more room. So I really do like the purse. I'm going to give you guys some close-ups of it. And then we're going to jump into the part you guys have been waiting for, the purse collection.
So, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I didn't want to hold up every person, like, talk about it. I felt like that would get really repetitive. And I thought it would just be easier just to show you guys my purses. And just put where they're from. And if I could find the price, how much they were. So, yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. If you guys want, like, another kind of collection video. Maybe, like, a glasses collection. Or anything like that. Let me know. And I can definitely do that for y'all. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up. And make sure y'all subscribe to my channel. And hit the bell so you guys are notified whenever I upload a new video. Follow me on my social medias if you haven't. And with all that being said, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Bye.